Greetings, iPhone iOS 7 users. You probably don't always travel with your laptop handy, and there might be many cases when you need to quickly send these files from your iPhone. If that's the case, listen up. By default, your iPhone can attach only the files that its default apps can open and keep. Photo files, video files, notes, and contact files. Sending other types of files like PDF or ZIP is also possible but requires downloading a third-party app. Let's start with easier tasks. The defaults. Here's how to attach and send photos. From the home screen, we tap the mail app icon to access the mail that we've started to write. Add a relevant email subject and double tap the text field of the email message. The stripe with extra options appears. Tap the little triangle on the right of the stripe to invoke extra options. Tap insert photo or video. The mail app will redirect you to your photos. Tap the album you're interested in and choose the picture you want to send. Tap choose to confirm the choice of the photo. Back to our unfinished message, tap send. The appearing menu offers us to reduce the message size by scaling the photo. We'll choose large, which is still a large picture in good quality, but smaller than actual size. The message is sent. What about multiple photos? We hear ya. Just check another How Tech tutorial named How to Email Multiple Photos on iPhone or iPad Running on iOS 7 to learn how to do it. Let's now send a video with your beloved iDevice. From the home screen, tap the Mail app icon again and tap the little pen and paper icon at the bottom of the screen. Start the new message, add the recipient's email, add the subject, now again double tap the text field. Tap the little triangle to invoke more extra options and choose Insert Photo or Video. Just the same as you did with Attaching Photo, except that this time you'll pick a video from Videos. Tap Choose and wait until compression happens. Tap Send. Mission complete. Sending the contact works a bit different. Access your Contacts app and choose the contact that you want to send. Scroll down a bit and choose Share Contact. Tap Mail you'll see the new message menu with the contact attached to it as a VCF file. That will do. Just fill out all the email fields and tap send. The contact is shared. If you're now wondering how to send other files, chances are you don't have a Dropbox on your computer. Not a big deal. Tap App Store and search for Dropbox. It's a free app. Download and install it. When you open your Dropbox, it will ask you to either register a new account or use the existing one. You do have a Dropbox account, don't you? The trick in sending PDFs, Excel files, zip archives, and other unusual for iPhone's attachments is to have them embedded in your Dropbox account beforehand. You'll have to do it using your computer. Right now, we have one PDF file in our Dropbox. We choose it and tap the little sharing icon in the lower left corner. From all sharing options, we choose Email. Tap Send and your PDF, Excel, or any other not-so-usual attachment will be sent to recipients as a link to your Dropbox. The recipient will just have to click on the link to download the file. Dropbox is not the only app that does this job, but is probably one of the best free apps out there. Now you know how to attach different files to email on iPhone and send them out to recipient. This was a How Tech tutorial. Like us on Facebook, love us forever, or leave us a comment here in the fields below. Thanks for watching.